Tells me about his sister and um, his sister's being trafficked. And he gives me this necklace. This is a real story. And, the, and when you get Santa Freedom, there's a, he's, you, even in the trailer, Caviso's always holding this necklace. The necklace is real. It's, it, I actually told the producers to consider not telling the story because people won't believe it. But the little boy gave me a necklace. It was a necklace that was like a rosary, like a prayer to him. And um, the necklace had my name on it. Wow. Uh, it was because it had a little scripture, 1 Timothy 6.11. And when I saw my name on it, he gave it to me, even though I was trying to give it back to him. It, it, was, a, it, it was like a calling. So from the beginning, to answer your question, how do you deal with this? Like, if you don't feel Jesus, if you don't feel God, if you don't feel the Spirit, you're not going to do this. Yeah. You're not going to, and if you try, you're not going to last. Like, at least I wouldn't. I wouldn't last. Yeah. Um, you know, so it, everything is faith to me. Everything is knowing what Jesus says about hurting kids, that it's better than a millstone be hung around your neck. And you toss the bottom of the sea. So you, he, he's clear where he stands on it. And when, when you, ha when you ha that gives you confidence in the Lord because you know where he stands on it. Right. He's fiercely, I mean, it's, it's mafioso talk. Yeah. Like I, you sink to the bottom of the sea with a millstone around your neck. Like it's, it's only right because Jesus is saying it in this case mm, and yeah. you know he means it. So, so that's how I, that's the only way I can say I can even deal with it or heal from it is, is through Jesus.